Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily inspiration card reading. If you would like a personal reading with me, do not wait, okay? Go to angelsouls444.com, check the description box for all the upcoming lives. I'm going to have a lot of them, okay? <laughs> so you can get your tickets down below. All right, well, let's see what we have for today. Bethany, all right. When you take excellent care of yourself, everybody benefits. Give yourself a relaxing treat today, such as a massage, sea salt bath, or pedicure. Um, was that yesterday or one of the days we were talking about not feeling, I think it was on the patient's day when, when that came up. Um, not feeling guilty as you transform into someone else, okay? <laughs> as you go on to the next phase. Um, things that once brought you joy, maybe don't bring you joy anymore or... Um, you know, whatever defines your sense of purpose, maybe you're moving on to something else and you are exploring now in this does say work on the self care so that you feel at peace. So you feel harmonious. Um, but whatever that looks like for you, I know for me taking a hike on a beautiful day, uh, in the Rockies really resets me and is so good for my soul. <laughs> it really is provided I'm not getting harassed or, um, some fool is following me around, you know, you know, whatever. But, um, you know, this is definitely taking a beat, taking a beat because you've gone through all this transformational energy. This is something that's always happening. And every time I post a message, there's, there's sort of a ping, a little mm, offshoot for you to go look at and to explore, right. To be in that energy. It's going to be different for everybody, but this is definitely coming out of feeling, perhaps internally conflicted and going, you know what? I'm going to be okay with the new version of me. Uh, now I'm a woman who, you know, since I've never had a thin day in my life. So for me, body positivity, I know that that other side really bothers me when people who have never had to struggle with their weight totally don't get it. And they're always the ones with the biggest mouths and the biggest opinions about it. And unfortunately they land in jobs like the in the medical industry, having no understanding what goes on, being nutritionists, um, trainers, having no idea <laughs> what this is like. But this is that kind of feeling of, you know, for an example I was giving, you know, I grew up in the 80s and the 90s and having my body type in the 90s was like a sin, okay? it And then it was a lot of... Um, it was a lot of weird messaging, like you're too fat. And then, um, I would get this other kind of messaging that because I was shaped the way that I am still am at 46, uh, that I am somehow obscene. Like my body is obscene. Uh, check back on, I think it was, vol uh, vet what? I almost said volunteers day. <laughs> Valentine's day. Whoa. Um, this was 2014. I want to say, I've used this example before. I'll use it again. Yes, it has to do with this Bethany card. Hang with me. So I had, you know, pulled the scene back a little bit because I had decorated behind me. And so from there, I had from here up. Okay. What do you think I got? What do you think I filmed from here up? Do you know who the worst offenders were? You had the disgusting comments from men. <sighs> Middle-aged white women. Coming in and basically telling me my body is too distracting. You're showing off. Basically, I was disgusting. I'm using my body. Basically calling me, you know, all kinds of things. And uh, that I am laying that example down because this, it, it's like never good enough, right? And then the Bethany card, and this is why I'm saying this. The Bethany energy here, or this card energy, I don't know where the name Bethany came from, but... <laughs> This, um, this energy here is stopping and going, okay, I'm not going to let that in anymore. My body is my body. I'm sorry if your jealousy makes your head spin. Okay. Uh, like the exorcist, right? <laughs> sorry. Um, I'm sorry if you have a problem with how I look, maybe work on your own self-hatred and stop projecting that out on everybody else. I'm going to be over here taking care of me. And part of that self-care is having that realization that just because someone says there's something wrong with, in this example, your body, 
doesn't make it true. Okay, so embracing that for yourself, understanding that's a huge part of self-care, taking the opinions of others, throwing them in the trash when they're negative. Okay, and that's where they belong. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.